Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to discuss about slider control implementation in Pega. Let's get started into the topic. So this is one of the way where we can provide user to enter some value which is having some range like from 1 to 100 or whatever it is. So here uh, I'm providing a feature to the customer to while applying loan how much amount uh, the customer is willing to borrow it. So instead of giving a text box and entering that value so to enhance the uh, look and feel of our application the, this is like slider option. So how we can implement that in Pega is uh, all about this video. So in the sections if you go here and you click on plus under pickers you can see slider so this is one of the ui control picker we have in pega so this slider i have opened it so you can see this is the otb rule px slider control that is where you can uh, configure with some values so for this slider you have to create a property which is of integer type that is only very useful for us so this is a otb control you can see this is a ui element and this is html where uh, the image uh, this control image is there right this is uh, defined over here this is the control that is why you are seeing that so here they have defined this and the category of pickers that is why we can see in pickers so this is a final rule where you can't do any modifications so coming to the section now i am giving some label value and this is some integer property that i have defined this is normal visibility disable uh, we have and this is like a starting range whether it is a number or some property reference so now I want to present numbers ranging from 1 to 100. This is 1 and this 100. But the interval between one digit to another digit is 10. I have given. Suppose if I want it as 5, I can give 5. And if I submit, our slider will be bigger one. You can see here. Now if I give uh, this to 20 for example and submit it, you can see 120, 141, 61, 81 and the last one would be 100 and this is show captions if i enable these captions then only you can see these digits 121 so now if i remove it and submit it now you can't see this and coming to presentation you have edit options where based on your respect to harness you can play around this and this is orientation where you want to define it is in horizontal way or a vertical way so if i give a vertical it would be asking some height i'm giving some pixels so this is uh, this so now i'm launching a case and i'm doing actions refresh you can see pixel control i did not say this sorry that's why still it is in horizontal way yeah this one now the thing is how or if i'm selecting 121 how can how is this getting affected so on selection of this under actions i have given an add event change and this post value and i have defined another uh, property and this property i'm doing a property set so whenever under actions i'm doing a set value of score comp to the value that user has selected such that whenever we are uh, doing a slide of this you can see there is a change in value yeah so this is all about slider control in pega you try from your side changing this color so so there are different scenarios like if uh, status is undefined or it would be like this and if it is uh, error it would be in red color and if it is success it is green so it's like a task for you guys like to see how we can uh, change the color of this slider if you find that information please comment on this video thanks for watching this video please subscribe share like and comment